Hello everybody, welcome to Impressive Image Maker channel. This is Toshiyagi from beautiful little island Okinawa, Japan. I'm a photographer, I shot this image for a long time ago and uh, I colorized a couple days ago and I finished up this kind of illustration type image and uh, I was looking at this image but I saw the different images in between editing films, I mean uh, editing movies. So I decided to make another variation of this image which is more effective on uh, mushrooms, I thought. Well, let's get started. Okay, I have this image, black and white original image. The blend mode is color And I have these layers I haven't fixed yet. And this one has mask. So I'm going to take this one on down, mask off. It's color 90%. Okay, let's see. First, this one is mushrooms color. Multiply and then this is mushroom color as well, but uh, blend mode too. Uh, blend mode color. Two layers of mushrooms. Then this is shadow of the mushroom, which is watercolor I added. Well, this is pretty interesting color, isn't it? Let me see. Okay, and then uh, this is background color. And uh, this one is pencil drawing type image. Now it's blend mode is pin light, but I want to change this. Let's see, like a color burn. Rose real dark contrast. A linear burn. This one is pretty effective. I kind of like this strong image. We see the window frame more, more dark shabby look. And uh, well, this is the original black and white as a base image. When you change opacity, it goes a little more lighter. Need some about 20. I'm looking at shadow side, maybe about 20. About here, then I just want to see a little bit more shadow, but I want tabletop to be more density. Background's all, all right. Let's see if why this is. Shadow image color, leave it about 40 or so. This one is, and this is well, mushrooms top color, brownish. That's all right. Maybe just one color layer is all right, huh? More light image. So this. See mushroom top. It's now multiply, but maybe to color burn. Then tone down. Oh, about 50. A little bit contrast, huh? So I go this. This is just color. This is original black and white image. It's now color burn. Hmm, kind of interesting, the luminosity. Looks like a soft image, huh? Looks real soft. Let me see this base. Hmm, change about 50% of this base image. Shows more tabletop density. Then this top, original black and white image. Luminosity 100. Compared to this color burn effect, color burns real contrast, harsh, kind of dramatic color burn. Pretty effective, huh? But change back to luminosity. Mush mushrooms real look soft. 
I want to show this mushroom to be real soft touch image, but the background is kind of maybe a linear burn or color burn, sort of uh, dramatic contrast. Let me see if I change this base image. I want this mushroom to be real soft, nice look on like this image. So why don't I fix this image as one layer first of all. Then change this image back to color burn to make it more impre impressive image, kind of dramatic contrast. Then just over soft touch. Let me try that. Okay, change back this one to 50%. Change this top layer to luminosity to show mushroom to be real soft image. Okay, let me fix this as a one layer. So select multiple. Two, three, four, five, six, all the way down. Then duplicate layers. Then merge selected. Okay, one I got to this image. This one is soft ma uh, mushrooms image. Then just turn it off right now. Then let's back to this black and white image. Lumina uh, luminosity to color burn. Then change this bottom original image tone down to well about 25 now. Then let me see this soft mushroom image. Then create empty mask. Now reveal with basic to soft round opacity. Okay. Invert this mask. Then reveal only this mushrooms. Okay, now we are looking at soft mushrooms. Now I want to change some colors. Yeah, I want to add some more reddish image on this color of the mushroom. Hmm, this yellow comes from where? Oh, all right, right here. Okay, in this case, I think, yeah, this is top layer, so, okay, I'm gonna soften up this shadow, just hide some. This is interesting. Okay, I'm gonna add on here some touch reddish color let me turn this on off so we see this reddish color right here mushrooms. The one I made, the other variation is, I was not sure the people looking at this image, what's this? Well, pretty much contrast. These are colors. This is watercolor image on shadow side. It's alright. Maybe I can burn down the corner. Maybe, well, 
Let me try on this base image. It's 20 now. Okay. Only for this. Appearances. Brightness. Maybe. Brightness down. And contrast down. More effective. Then uh, make mask. Create empty mask. Invert mask. Then reveal with real soft. Soft round size flow. Burn down the corner. Yep. Well, I guess that's it. Result is a little bit soft image of the mushrooms and a burn down corner then dramatic lighting more emphasize yeah now we can tell these are mushrooms easy and I just combine this image well that's it for today and uh, thank you for watching my video today is just touch up this images I made a couple days ago and uh, thank you and I really appreciate for you guys support and uh, I hope this movie is gonna give you some kind of idea for your creative work and uh, you guys have a nice day and see you next time bye now ciao